Bud Light's latest commercial ignited scorn and derision from social media users online, who said the spot unwittingly depicted Brewer Anheuser-Busch's failure to address its ill-fated tie-up with transgender influencer Dylan Mulvaney. The nation's top-selling beer brand which has been gradually losing market share to upstart Modelo a special and other rivals over the course of recent weeks, posted the lighthearted commercial on its official social media page on Sunday. It shows a picnic-goer heartily devouring a watermelon while inclement weather sends others in the area scurrying for cover as paper plates and cans of Bud Light are sent flying. The woman eating the watermelon observes the chaos surrounding her and simply continues on as if nothing happened. It's fine, this is fine, the caption read, mimicking a popular meme which depicts a dog drinking coffee while his home is engulfed in flames. Reaction on Twitter was scathing from users who continue to insist that Anheuser-Busch offer a full-throated apology for its decision to partner with Mulvaney. Uh, nope. We are done with you, wrote one Twitter user who urged a boycott of Bud Light. Another Twitter user commented that the commercial was a depiction of what was taking place at Bud Light's corporate office. We're getting an inside look at Bud's corporate office today. After talking with representatives, they say, it's fine, this is fine, the Twitter user wrote. This brand seems to have hit rock bottom, another Twitter user wrote. Bud Light was added once again on Monday, posting another Twitter item showing a GIF animation of a beer can being cracked open. The best beer is an open beer, the caption on the tweet read. Naysayers posted snarky responses, including one who wrote, based on your declining sales and market share, the best beer is literally anything else. The Twitter commenter posted a photo of a bottle of Modelo a special whose global distribution is owned by Anheuser-Busch InBev but whose U.S.-based operations are run by Constellation Brands. Meanwhile, sales of Bud Light continued to